The Bonville Road deviation forms part of the $1.6 billion Pacific Highway upgrade, funded by the Federal and New South Wales governments. The $245 million project upgrades 9.8 kilometres of the Pacific Highway, south of Coffs Harbour on the mid-north coast of New South Wales, to a dual carriageway bypassing Bonville Village. Utilising prefabricated 500 plus BAMTEC carpets from one still reinforcing led to considerable savings in time and labour. One still reinforcing 500 plus rebar still reinforcing is welded to specific dimensions onto flexible steel straps. These are then rolled up for ease of handling and delivering to site. When needed, the 500 plus BAMTEC roll is craned into a specially designed jig onto the back of a semi-trailer. It's then simply unrolled and tied onto the roadway. This process is much more efficient than if individually stock rebar were used, thereby reducing the number of steel fixes required on site. The 500 plus BAMTEC carpets weigh just over 1.5 ton each and are made using 16 mm longitudinal and 12 mm transverse 500 plus rebar from one steel reinforcing. In total, 900 500 plus BAMTEC carpets were fabricated by one steel reinforcing with an overall weight of almost 1,400 tonne. The task we were doing was by hand, manually. Um, it was very hard and uh, not very productive and not profitable. Uh, this one is the first time using BAMTEC rolls. It's always used stock bar. But we've adapted it to suit BAMTEC rolls and it's going for the uh, we've put rollers and things in, we've changed the magazine area where the transverse carpets are uh, located. Not, not a great deal of adaption. The product's good, the spacings of the bars are all nice and neat and tidy, it's, uh, it's a pretty good job. Nicely welded, it's quite, stamped. It's quite a sound job. Well the previous system of laying stock bar was very good, uh, but we had to use a lot more men. We can get 500 metres out of stock bar and we can get 500 metres out of this with less men per day and that's a, a reasonable day. This is a better product in that terms of the welding work that's done in the factory has replaced some of the time that needs to be done out in the field. Uh, today we'll do 620 metres to finish by about 4 o'clock today so that's about 8 hours, 8 and a half hours. So that's, that's pretty productive. Yeah, our H&S is good. Um, there's better angles for them to work at. Uh, they can get a, sit down and relax if they want to when, in between the moves. And they don't have to pick any bars up and handle them. So basically all they're doing is just tying. No, no manual handling at all.